The historic storms that swept across the USA this year left houses and cars underwater. Actually, thousands of cars washed away and flooded. This is one of those vehicles caught up in Hurricane Ida in this South Orange, New Jersey parking lot in September. And we're about to open its doors for the first time since the storm. Let's check it out. Oh my God. <laughs> That's so gross. Jeez. There's mold everywhere. This is pretty gross. Yeah, it is. Undrivable. It's undrivable, won't start. It should just be uh, junk for parts. Junk indeed. And yet, experts warn after every major flood, thousands of vehicles like this one are cleaned up and resold to unsuspecting buyers. That's what Joyce Darden says happened to her used car. She says she bought it from Enterprise Car Sales for $17,000. Now every morning, the 80-year-old suits up. No, it has nothing to do with COVID. Joyce says her car is actually making her sick. Houston auto appraiser Roy Bent inspected the car and within minutes he spotted what he says is proof of mold and water damage. That's oh, rust. Wow. That's a lot of rust. That is a telltale sign that the vehicle's been involved in a flood. He says another dead giveaway, it's a flood car. Seeing sand in your engine, you should not have any sand in here. Do you see that? Yeah. He says the car's electrical components are also compromised, including the airbag. Joyce says her doctors believe her headaches, earaches, and sinus infection were triggered by severe mold exposure. Every time she jumps in here and steps on the floor and runs the AC. She's just breathing it, breathing it. Mold expert Hansel O'Halloran says he found needs. extreme levels of toxic mold in the carpets of her vehicle. This should never happen to anybody. Experts say there are nearly 400,000 flood damaged vehicles on the road today. Enterprise tells us there was no record of water damage to the car before they sold it and that they stand by the sale. They also say they offered to inspect the car and buy it back. And how can you tell if you've got a flood car? Well, come to our website, InsideEdition.com, for some tips on that.